All right, guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can connect your Twilio account to your SMS at CRM so that way you can connect new phone numbers and existing phone numbers from your Twilio account to send and receive text messages and phone calls. Let's dig into it. All right, guys, just follow along with me as I'm setting this up so that way you can set up your Twilio too. Make sure to pause as we go along so that you're doing this step by step with me. So first things first, make sure that you have your Twilio account open in another tab or another window so that way we can make sure to pull the information we need uh, and plug it in to your SMS at CRM. So let's dig into it. First things first, you're gonna click on where it says SMS Gateway and SMPP. You're gonna click this blue arrow. And what we're looking for is this one where it says connect SMS gateways. We're gonna click connect. It's gonna default with a bandwidth usually, but we're gonna click the drop down, and we're gonna looking for Twilio. Once we have Twilio, you're gonna be brought to a page that looks like this or something like this. And what we need to do is we need to grab specifically the account SID and the auth token. These are the two most very important things we need to grab to complete the initial setup for Twilio. Once we grab this information, your phone and your phone number will be set up for everything that you need for incoming and outgoing text messages. So first things first, navigate over to your Twilio. Uh, let's go over there now. Great, we're here. Now that we're here, what you wanna grab is your account SID first. So we're gonna click right here where it says copy, and then we're gonna go back to our CRM, and we're gonna place that here in this box. Next, it wants an auth token. So we're gonna go back to Twilio. And once we're here, we're going to where it says auth token here. And this is all on your homepage. This is as soon as you log into your Twilio, it should be here. But we're going to click copy on the auth token and we're going to go back to our CRM software. Once here, we're going to plug that code in and then we're going to have everything we need. Now we simply click save. Excellent. Now that we've clicked save and we've connected our Twilio account SID and token, we now have the ability to purchase a phone number through Twilio. Let me show you how that works. You're gonna click where it says get a new number. You're gonna click right here on this blue arrow and you just select the one that you want. Now with the A2P regulations that are going on right now, I am not going to purchase a local number. I will instead be purchasing a toll-free number, uh, which for a lot of people might be the best option as well. So I'm simply going to select my country um, in the United States and then right here where it says local, I'm going to switch it to toll free and I'm going to click search. Once I click search, it's going to have all of these options. I simply click the one that I want to add. So I'm gonna click get this number. And voila, now I have clicked that and I purchased the phone number and you're gonna see this phone number display right here. So this tells me I've got it connected. So we just covered how to set up a brand new phone number that you've purchased through your SMS at CRM using your Twilio gateway. But what if you already have a phone number in your Twilio gateway? How do you get that phone number into your SMS at CRM so that you can utilize it for your incoming and outgoing text messages? Let me show you. First things first, you wanna click on your name in the top left and you want to go to profile. Once you are here on profile, you want to go to where it says active phone numbers. From here, you want to click on add number. And then where it says SMS gateway, you want to change that to be Twilio. Next, we want to go into our Twilio account where we're going to find the phone number that we need. So I'm going to click into Twilio. Once here, I'm going to look to the left where it says phone numbers. And then I'm going to select manage from the drop down and navigate to active numbers. Once I am at the active numbers, I can choose whatever phone number I'd like to connect to my SMS and CRM if it's already an established number. Now, you'll notice the phone number that I connected while we were in this exercise is already showing here as all set up. Now, I wanna connect the next one. I simply need to click on the phone number that I wanna have set up within my SMS at CRM. So I'm gonna select this one. And as soon as it loads, I'm first going to collect the phone number and then I'm gonna collect a special code. So let's grab the phone number first. I'm going to collect this 
I'm gonna head over here to my SMS at CRM system. I'm going to where it says phone number. I'm gonna put that phone number in. I wanna remove any hyphens or special characters, but I do wanna add the country code. Uh, just the number, not any plus signs. So I am in the United States, my country code is one. The next thing I need to do is I need to grab the phone SID account. So to do that, I'm gonna go back to my Twilio account where I just grabbed the phone number and I'm gonna click on properties. Once here, I'm looking for the phone SID number. Simply gonna grab that. I'm gonna head back to my SMS at CRM system and I'm going to copy that in there just like this. And once that's done, I simply need to click save. Excellent, okay, so it's all set up. I know it worked because now I have both of the phone numbers that I had. This was the one I purchased with you in this example. This is the one that I already had in my Twilio account that I brought over. They both say that they're set up for the Twilio gateway, so I know they're both through Twilio. There's one final thing I wanna do to make sure you're all set up and then you are good to go. What I would like for you to do, and this is only something you need to do if it's from an existing phone number in your Twilio account. You wanna go right here where it says SMS gateways and SMPP on the left-hand side. And you're gonna click connect SMS gateways. From here, select the Twilio gateway. And I want you to find where it says SMS webhook URL. Grab that link right there, copy it, and go back to your phone number where we were just at and click configure. Once here, I want you to scroll down to where it says messaging configuration and make sure this is set up with that link that you just grabbed. Once you're done with that, click save and that's all you need to do. From there, your phone is set up and ready to go. And for good measure, let's give it a test. All right, so now we can test it out and just make sure it works, right? So what I'm gonna do is from the home screen, I'm gonna navigate to where it says text. And I'm gonna send a test with both of the numbers I set up. All right, so I have two numbers I'm gonna test. The first one is a number that I bought while connected to the SMS at CRM with my Twilio gateway. The second number I wanna test is the Twilio phone number that was purchased prior to my connection with the SMS at CRM, right? So let's test both and see what happens. First things first, from the text, you wanna choose your phone number, it, whatever phone number it is, grab it, click on manual if you don't have contacts added, and then just grab a phone number, random phone number that you have, make sure you plug the country code in front of it, and then you can say your message. So, hey, from, I wanna test the 833 number, and then I'm gonna click send message. Awesome, okay, so I'm gonna double check to make sure that was sent. What I wanna do is I wanna go to where it says smart inbox on the left-hand side, and I want to see if a message was sent out or not. So I'm going to go over here to Smart Inbox, wait for it to load. And awesome, that went through. So that that is exactly what it's going to look like. Now I want to do the same thing and I want to test it with the other phone number to make sure that it went through. So I'm going to go to text. I'm going to use the drop down. I'm gonna select the other toll free number that I purchased. I'm gonna say, hey, from 844. And I'm going to select manual. I'm gonna do that same phone number. And then I'm gonna scroll down and hit send a message. Now I'm gonna go back to my smart inbox and I'm gonna make sure it went through. So give it a moment to load. Make sure you connect your inbox. If you're wondering what the smart inbox is, don't worry, we are going to have a video that shows you all about it. All right, guys, so the system is now set up and functional and ready to go for all incoming and outgoing text messages. As you can see, I've got both of these texts, one from 833, one from 844. My system is primed and ready for all things SMS. That said, it is important to note that this setup that we did did not set up your SMS at CRM system to have voice functionality with your Twilio gateway. There's going to be another training video showing you how to set up your voice settings. So if you need that, make sure you refer to that once that training is released. And I will see you in whatever next video I happen to see you in. Have a good one.